not very many chinks in the armor, no. but uh, we'll see if she uh, comes out of the gates firing. All right, here comes the top seed. Let's play pickleball and a beautiful backhand volley and a fist Boy. pump early. That's not good news for Lena. No. One zero. Oh no. Boy. It's the last thing you want to see from Anna Lee Waters. She's lost but twice this year in singles, once to Catherine Parento in Florida, and then Hurricane Tyra Black got her in a semifinal in California. And that is the no go zone, both in singles and in doubles. High to the Anna Lee two-hander does not usually end well for you. It's just going to get wrecked cross court. The first ball from Lena was terrific. What a great stab from Anna Lee. Yes. Point. Out? No? Okay. I don't know what happened there. That was close. Lena's yeah. playing it good. I think that she called it good. Four zero. One-handed lob on the run. Some great court coverage from Padiga Meta there. Gets the ball back. Another one of the Austin area crew here. Colin, like yourself, is Lena. Yes. Slide out. Yeah, Italy looking very sharp early. No doubt. Four zero. Four zero. Now the ladies stay back on the return much more than the men. Why is that, Colin? Um, well, the men just generally are taller and cover the court a little bit better than the women do. So coming forward doesn't have as much risk. And the passing shots are, you know, more or less the same. The men might be able to hit it slightly harder, but there's just more risk if you come forward when you're the ladies, just because your movement along the line does not live up to what the other ladies are bringing at you from the baseline. Four one. One of the best grunters there is Lena. Yes, and I think that if she has a chance in this match, she's got to use her height by coming forward. So staying back on the return to me doesn't make a whole lot of sense because it's more valuable at the front of the court than at the back of the court. Slide out. Four one. Should two go. A couple of really nice rolls from Padiga Meta down at the Anna Lee Waters' ankles, but she's able to get that back too. You don't give her enough credit for the those shots. We love the highlight reels. Yeah, those are the ones that you play and replay over and over. But she's very disciplined. Doesn't make a lot of loose errors, even on tough balls like that. And Lena's going to run through these, but um, it really hits you like a ton of bricks at times. And it's not because you sweat a lot, unlike Florida, but it just feels really hot on your skin. Point. 7-1. Great Side volley up. there from Padiga Meta. 1-7. That's just too good. Side out. I mean, you're supposed to come in behind a ball that's deep and in the middle to take angles away. Yep, and she still finds an angle down the line. And Seven, she's one. striking the ball this cleanly. There's not a whole lot that Lena can do. I mean, that is a frustrating point for Lena there. She had 
Anna Lee reaching to the last inch of the paddle multiple times and still wins the rally. Yep. Definitely frustrating. I feel like she's just got to open up the shoulders a little bit and say, I'm, I'm down, I'm not expecting to win. Let me just rip everything and see if I can get Anna Lee a little bit off here because everything is dropping in. Run around the forehand in the middle of the court inside out winner. Thanks for coming. Yeah, that should tell you just how much confidence she has in that backhand. Nine one. Wow. Oh, add a little oh. backhand slice. Point. Little tennis, <laughs> tennis approach shot there. there. Yeah. Has she been out on her in the Ten week? One. So here we go. Game point for Anna Lee. Point and game, 11 one. Gets a gift from Good Lena. Game. So very tidy, 11 1. Connor Garnett and the other one. Congrats to those four. Yeah, great effort by Lohani making semifinals. That's got to be the deepest he's ever made it. And uh, this is actually a major. So as many points as uh, are, are available are available here. Yeah, and we talked about the race earlier, Connor, before you joined us to try and get into the top positions to qualify for San Clemente. Point. Just wide for Padigameta there. And Anna Point Lee, zero. when she is up and feeling good, is going to play extremely fast. Signed up. Zero one. Slide up. What do you say? <laughs> Too good. <laughs> Tip your cap. One zero. Oh, there it is again. What is happening? As if she needs to uh, work on another shot here. Let's. Uh, and we talked about your brother. Our horses. Let's not give you too much artillery. <laughs> talked about your brother and the two-handed backhand. Now we're seeing the slice Side approach. Out. Folks, this is the deal. The best players are never satisfied with where they're at, and you are seeing it live on your screens today. 360, and then beautiful rope from Padigameta right there. Diga Mates is one of the moms on tour, and uh, you'll be playing with one of them tomorrow in mixed, Elise Jones. Zero one. Indeed. Slide out. Um, Linasan Agilis. Definitely a very Lithuanian name, <laughs> yes. if you ask me. One zero. A lot of energy. Uh, Slide out. Anna, Anna Lee was well off the baseline there and still missed the serve deep. Zero I was going to say, she's, I don't remember her no. adding that in the past either. We're, we're a couple new tricks here. Yep. Although that's not a new trick. The drive cross no. court down the line off of both sides is uh, alive and well. Yep. One zero. Look at how far back she is here. I want a cut to go with it. There's all sorts of sorcery coming. That's really nice from Padigameta right there. And that's where she has the advantage. She's got the reach, so uh, get up there and Zero get one. involved. Point. One, one. That's just so good. Again, just 16 one, years one. of age and dominating the sport of pickleball is Side Anna up. Lee Waters, and I'll send her a apology postcard as that was three squares up from the bottom of the net right there. One, one. Again, quarterfinal action here on the ladies' side. Side up. What can Lena do here to try and get 
a little momentum going here, Colin. One, one. Yeah, you want to get some scoreboard pressure for sure. So even if it was only a one or two point lead, I feel like that would help her a lot. Maybe Inali doesn't feel quite as free. Starts to miss a couple more because um, if he stays as hot as that first game, it's going to be really tough. Winner of this will get Dominique Schaefer, who just beat Arena Tereschenko 7-11, 11-5, 11-0. Oh, how about the tape helping you out as well? Yes, many of those, as many as possible. And I guess we'll see a new match up here in the semifinals with, uh, I think that's Schaefer's first semifinal, in my recollection. I think you're right, Two, one. on the PPA side for sure. Just deep from Lena. Side out. One, two. Point. And that's just got so much pace. Yep, and you see Lena going to more of the cut volley there, which if you can, you want to hit more of the two, flatter two. topspin volleys, but that one diving so quickly, she's kind of forced to come down on it. Slide out. Other half of the draw, Catherine Parenta will play Taylor Garcia and Mary Brasha against Jamie Haas. So. Uh, had some upsets and a notable withdrawal or two on the ladies' side. Yep, two, two. two. Names. Yeah. Played by Padigameta, and uh, Anna Lee is marching back into the shade here. Time out receiver. In the second game and bouncing around a little extra. Vim Three, and her step. Let's see if she can keep it going. Yeah. I mean, it's the shot before that, Colin, that was really good. Yeah, and as soon as she got her feet set on the backhand, we're like, uh-oh, yeah, something that... bad's gonna happen. Two, three. She's got a guess at that point. You don't always know what, but you know something bad's gonna happen for that position. Yes, it's almost Point. Halloween. Where's the Reaper coming from? And the two-meter <laughs> backhand was down the line there. Get out the scythe. <laughs> I mean, this is October, so I feel it like is. that we didn't jump the gun. No, we did not. If it was Reaper. September, that's totally uncalled for. Point. No one can say we don't have fun with the booth here, Dave. That's not, it's not acceptable if we don't. Four, three. Waters nose is back in front, up one. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Point. Was, uh, air melt. And quickly. When you have a chance to finish, you Five, really three. got it closed out. Slide out. Okay, so. Out of the timeout. Uh, you feel like the, the new person in the world. Uh, yeah. I, I'm Reap dying off. to get answers to these new Oh, yeah, we tricks. got. Point. And of course, you do not get extra points for hitting the guaranteed rate sign on a return. So within one for Lena, and again, just trying to keep pressure on oh Annalie my. Waters. Point. We'll stare back at the court there. Yeah, no guaranteed rate sign in that particular no, area, no. but about the same height up the net. Five, five. Tied at five, so a nice response here. It's been gifted to her, but she'll take it. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice shot. Point. So a little Annalie, too cute. Uh, giving her a little opportunity there, but that's not an easy shot to control when you're running forward like that. The momentum can take the Six, ball five. too far or throw off your balance left and right. It's Slide just a, a matter of which side would we like to hit the winner on. Trick or treat, and it was a trick for sure. <laughs> Cross-court backhand winner for Anna Lee Waters there. But again, Padiga Meta, this Five is a lady seconds. that fights till the end every time and is up one. Side out. So easy. So easy. You also love that Anna Lee's having a little discussion with Anna Lee here, if you're Six Lena. Five. Uh, 
That is oh, a great volley up. on the stretch. Maybe 4,000 amateurs playing. It's going to be amazing November 5th through the 12th in Dallas. Slide out. So the second time out used by Anna Lee Waters. So there is no challenges left available to her, but uh, nice little Five slide seven. and hits it in the open court. Although we do have a new rule, Dave, where you yes. have a person's out of timeouts. If it's a game ending or match ending call, you Six, have seven. the capability to challenge the call. Yes, so we don't want to end in tragedy where someone lost because of a call that was missed. Yeah, we had a situation out at TOC in the semifinals of men's singles like that between Federico Staxford and Connor Garnett where there was a disputed call at the end. I can't remember which side it was on, but uh, seven, the match seven. ended with somebody wanting to challenge the ball and not being able to. Yep. So nice tweak there. That's the only place at 10, that's no good to get to 10, but at 10 match point down certainly will be there. And seven, seven. Nice you job. You definitely don't want a match to end. No. Unjustly. Especially when you have the ability to fix it. Ooh, Ooh I think they caught the line. And Lena Padigameta is within three points of game two. Eight, seven. Wow. Slide One out. millimeter above the tape right there. Great dip on that. Didn't hit it hard, but just low enough to force Lena to pop up. Seven, eight. Yeah, it's a great approach, smart. Staying away from the Annalee two-hander, not doing too much. Bunting it down the sideline and making Annalee come up with the forehand. Eight, seven. Doesn't look either, like either one of these no. ladies have the intention of coming forward anytime soon. And a big yell from Anna Lee Waters after a long tennis looking baseline rally there as Lina finally decided to come in behind this shot here and uh, did not get herself into a good position at all. Well, she might have uh, played an outball, it doesn't matter though. Lina ends up making the error on the next one. Timeout receiver, eight, eight. And blows it out or will eight, eight. Lina Padiga Mata force game three. Point. Oh, just missed it wide. Nine eight. hands from Lena Padiga Mehta to get the ball back at crunch time. Yeah, she was looking for a backhand and she ended up finding a backhand Eight, on nine. the forehand side on that volley. <laughs> this one right here. Yeah, another tennis battle. I'm just waiting for the Annalise slice down the middle. Point. Okay, and uh, a little frustration from Anna Lee Waters as she looks over at her mom, and we're tied at nine. Yeah, that little Ken Rosewall slice down the middle. Exactly. Where, okay. where was that? I apologize to those of you who have never heard of Ken Rosewall there, tennis legend. Oh, great use of length there, wow. What a battle, and it's Padiga Meta that has gotten herself to game point. Yes, and it was a really good drop by Anna Lee, but using that extra reach that she had on that one forehand, keeping Anna Lee back and ultimately winning the exchange. Oh, 
Ryan cross court draw. Oh, there it is. Oh, and just can't get there. The slice approaches continue. So a game point saved. Nine, 10. Can't she force extra pickle? Here we go. And uh, what a tragic moment for a missed return. Looks like it might be a moment for a timeout. I think she's looking for her towel, which is clearly not in that corner. 10-10. 10 10-10 10 if you're new to pickleball. Got to win by two. Oh, dear. Ooh, Ooh, man, plays might have gotten looked pretty out. That was a gift. Point. She'd back rather hand. pad the stats and scream. Yes, the lethal weapon of the backhand. And we Gets are at to match, match point. point. No. So we were at game point for Padiga Meta, and now match 11, point. 10. All the timeouts have been used. Here we go. And that will do it. What an effort from Lena Padigameta to have a chance to win.